You're a curious little boy, aren't you? Get rid of him! Run. Detective, I'm afraid you won't have much time to enjoy the beauty of Lake Simher, as we've got an urgent case for you. A few days ago, a young boy claimed he was attacked by savage, mechanical beasts. We thought it was a case of the boy who cried wolf, but then we discovered a strange magical artifact. The boy thinks the artifact had something to do with the attack. The goal of your mission is to find out more about it. Head to the city and begin your investigation. Good luck, detective. Easy, boy. Calm down. Let's see who this is. State your business. The Kingdom of Barja is closed to foreigners. An artifact, you say? That is just the kind of lore that appeals to our queen. But I can't let you pass. Well, not unless you want to help me out. I lost my hunting horn somewhere in the forest. I'd look for it myself, but I can't leave my post. Can you help me find it?
What do we have here? I am Princess Leda of Barja. I'm looking for the silver stags that have been terrorizing my people. Who are you, and what are you doing here? This is not a safe place. I'd advise you to leave. But perhaps fate has a role for you in all this. I suppose that remains to be seen. My trusty horn, and it's good as new! You keep your word, I see. Now it's up to me to keep mine. To get to the castle, follow the path to the village. There you'll see an old staircase. Take it. I'm off to check the perimeter, but I'll see you at the castle later.
Well, if it isn't my favorite detective, I knew you'd show up eventually. Nothing ever gets past you, does it? I owe you one, so I'll give you a warning. This case is far more complicated than you could possibly imagine. The stag attacks aren't even the half of it. And if you have any plans for that star, don't bother. I'll be the one to make a wish. Bye bye now.
I see you ignored my advice. That's too bad. Why are you still here? Impressive. Your persistence is commendable. I might as well tell you what I know about it myself. That, my dear detective, is just half of the greater, more powerful object. Each half contains part of a fallen star. You know what they say about that shooting star? Once complete, this thing will grant you any wish. But shh, it's a secret. Fairy tales aside, it would be a good idea to show it to Queen Vala. She might be of more help than me and my puny lore. Milady, you should know that the Queen won't appear for her speech until her sentry bear is repaired. Perhaps you could help in that regard, and she'll be thrilled to talk to you. Here, take this. It's not a lot, but it's a start.
My dearest citizens, my beloved friends, a terrible danger has befallen our magnificent kingdom of Barsha. Our neighbors, those Olesian traitors, take us for weaklings. They scheme to conquer us, drive us from our homes. They wish to erase us from history. Listen, can you hear the hooves of death approaching? They are nearly here now. But fret not, we are not waiting for them defenseless. Behold, our own mechanical protectors, our benevolent guardians, our golden bears! Alas, as mighty as they are, they won't be enough to repel an enemy that is so ruthless and numerous. I call on you to make a sacrifice. Grant me your strength that we can triumph over this tide of darkness. Let the bravest of you step forward. Be my champion in this righteous war. Brave people of Barsha, you will be my mighty hammer, my spear of light, my golden army. Do it, Goldilocks. Now! Good to see you're all right, detective. You should be more careful. I won't be around to save you next time. I don't know why Goldilocks would use her gift that way. I have a feeling that things are just going to get worse. I don't know much more, but I'm sure she does. I'm afraid that to ask her, you'll need to find a way into the castle. You helped me with that bear, so we're even. I've got to go.
You again? Be careful not to overstep your authority, detective. I assume you're shocked by what I did in the square. The transformation's temporary. The power of the star will make it right once we deal with the Elysian threat. Queen Vala promised that to me. And now, if you'll excuse me.
I know why you're looking for me. History troubles us both. I'll tell you what weighs on my mind. More than 20 years ago, King Vatsvav's daughters, Lida and Vala, were playing on the cliffs. Vala slipped and fell into the cold water. Lida ran for help, but she wasn't fast enough. The kingdom was at war. To keep the morale of the army high, the king kept Vala's death a secret. Lida begged the king to bring her sister back. My child. Even if there was a way to bring her back from death, the price would be too high. To comfort Lita, the king found the best craftsman in the kingdom. He made Lita a lifelike doll, but it didn't help. She prayed for the gift of the golden touch so she could pay the price of bringing her sister back. I granted her wish. After seeing what my help did to people, I decided not to interfere again. But I'll give you some advice. Go to the place where the queen keeps what's most precious to her. You'll find the truth amongst her things.
you doing here? I warned you, give me that! Is it possible? The Elysian threat, stag attacks, it was all just a trick? She used me! I'm so ashamed. I'll do everything I can to help put a stop to this. She's hiding in the caves. Follow me. We're here, but the door's locked. We need to open it to get to Vala. Here's your proof. This thing was supposed to be the first version of my sister. Vala died when she fell. The craftsman just made a machine. Whatever my sister is up to, he's the key. Maybe the automaton could tell us where to look for him.
I remember your face. My creator, where is he? I can sense him nearby. I was faulty, frail, and unworthy to harness the power of the star. Leave me be, sister. Let me fade and dream of the life I'll never have. Help! It's me, the Royal Craftsman. Quick, get me out of here!
The Queen plans to cross the barrier. Humans can't cross it, but an army of golden automatons can. The Queen herself is my masterpiece. If she uses a star as her core, she could do unimaginable things. So I've hidden the key to the last part of the star in the artifact you're holding. That should slow her down for a while. Detective, you explore the cave and look for my sister. I'll take the craftsman to safety. Looks like. It doesn't matter. Soon, I'll have the power to turn all of humanity into a flawless, obedient army. Goodbye, detective. I'll be seeing you soon. I hope you like the color of gold. Are you okay, detective? I found us a ship, but finding a way through the barrier won't be easy. 
our only hope lies in the tales of Bolvar the Merchant. Legends say that he knew of a way of traveling between Alicia and Barja. I found this on his ship. Find the rest of the document. I'll help Evan repair the ship. Good luck. Hey, those are Bolvar's notes. Let me take a look. I can read these runes. It says... Mm, mm, I will leave my dagger to King Boris the Wise, mm, because he's the only person who could resist using it. It's the only thing known that can open the barrier. It would be dangerous for it to wind up in the wrong hands. King Boris the Wise? He is buried at the shrine. Disturbing his resting place is next to sacrilege, but it's our best chance.
Now you have the power to cut through the barrier. We know that you'll use it for good. Your cause is just, and your heart is pure. It's up to you to stop the Queen from completing the star. Trying to sneak over the lake, detective? Give me the dagger, or I'll... Or you'll what? It's time, detective. Give me the dagger. I call the power of moon and sun. I call... It's as I suspected. The Queen's Corps doesn't have enough energy to power the army of automatons. I would not underestimate her. She's a formidable opponent. We have to stop her before she gets the star. Here, this may help you. It can be used to disable some of my earlier inventions.
Be careful, detective. It's likely that we'll find her more than prepared. Persistent. I could use that in a servant. Even better, you brought me the only thing I was missing. Sister, bring me that artifact and stand by my side while I make history. for turning my sister against me. Give me the artifact! Thank <laughs> you. 
Please, give me the star so I can make things right. I could wish for my loved ones to be alive again. I could wish for godlike powers or immortality. All the evil that befell the innocents and all the suffering caused by my actions. I wish to no longer have this gift and to undo the harm I did to the people of Barja.